So we have to now understand what are our maryadas, how we have to live within our maryadas. And I'm sure if you really work out your Sri Ganesha, for that the best is to meditate. Put yourself on some nice uh, turf, grass, sit on that, put your left hand with the light and right hand on the mother and say Atharvashish. If you can remember it by heart, it's a very good thing, otherwise you can keep the book and read it. Or say Ganesha's mantra to begin with. It's going to help you very much. It's going to help you, your eyes, it's going to your whole thing is going to be very nice. It's going
Дорогие братья и сестры, сегодня вас приветствует коллектив Сахаджи Югов Петрозаводска, Карелия. Буду проводить сегодня вебинар я, меня зовут Женя. Мы с вами когда-то встречались, и сегодня опять я с вами. Сегодня у нас очень интересная программа. Сегодня у нас в гостях наша сестричка из Финляндии Лили Ивановна. Она сегодня с нами на вебинаре, посмотрит, как у нас здесь все проходит интересно. И мы видим, у нас много уже хаджи-йогов с нами. Еще раз всех приветствую, Джиши Матаджи. Давайте поднимем энергию и выровняем поле. Поднимем наше внимание высоко. Произнесем ОМ. Дорогие братья и сестры, мы продолжаем вас знакомить с Карелией. В Карелии очень много мест силы. И недавно наш брат Алеша он ездил в парк по Наярве. Приехал он весь изменившийся, он помолодел, весь светится. Он был на горе Кивака. Это одна из самых высоких гор Карелии. Находится на территории национального парка по Наярве. Вот можете туда съездить тоже. Она находится в Ловском районе. Название Кивака – Киви-Ака. Каменная баба или каменная хранительница. И голова чем-то напоминает, ой, эта гора напоминает женскую голову. Если посмотреть с одной стороны, она представляется в облике женщины, а с волосами, подобранными в пучок. А если смотреть с другой стороны, это сейт, а, похожий на старуху в платке. Вот так а, этот камень выглядит и является священным сакральной вершиной. Мы сделали вам небольшой видеоряд с фотографиями.
прекрасные фотографии, музыка. Подробно о горе Кивака Алексей расскажет вам на последующих вебинарах. Не пропускайте, будьте в курсе. А сейчас мы с вами сбалансируемся и затем посмотрим лекцию Шриматаджи. Где Шриматаджи? Поднимем внимание высоко. Разнесем О. Давайте опустим наши руки к земле. Мать земля, пожалуйста, почисти нас. Питай все негативные энергии. И даруй нам свою силу, чистоту. Произнесем мантру Адип Хоми Деви. Еще раз. Откроем руки. Давайте еще раз сбалансируемся, поднимем энергию. руки, прислушаемся к своим вибрациям на руках, над головой, ом, левую руку откроем, правую к земле, мать, пожалуйста, войди в наш левый канал. Балансируй и почисти. Произнесем три раза звук Са. Пропоем мантру Махакали Пхайрава. Букса. Правую руку откроем, левую в эфир. Ну, и, пожалуйста, почисти наш правый канал. Три раза хам. Мантра Махасарасвати Хануман. Хам. Достаточно откроем руки. Ом. Внимание на первый центр. Мать, ты есть Шриганыша. Пожалуйста, сделай нас чистыми, невинными, 
мудрыми и проницательными. Произнесем 12 имен Шри Ганыши. Сумукха, Экаданта, Капила, Гаджакарнака, Ламводар, Виката, Викнанаша, Ганатхип, Тхумракету, Ганатьякша, Халачандра, Гаджананах. Левая рука открыта, правая к земле. Держим внимание на первом левом. Мать сделана нас чистыми, невинными. Пропоем мантру Нирмал Ганыш. Еще раз. Нирмал Ганыш. Правую руку откроем, левую к земле. Внимание на первом правом. Мать, только ты уничтожаешь все демоническое, все негативное, все, что атакует нас изнутри и снаружи. Мантра Шри Картикея. Еще два раза мантра Шри Картикея. Откроем руки. Внимание на первом центре и вверх Сахасрару. Ом. Внимание на первом центре. Пропоем три раза мантру Шриганыша. Разнесем еще раз он. Подкинем нашу энергию вдоль тела вверх несколько раз и выровняем вокруг Сахасрары, вокруг Аги. И еще раз подкинем. Помассируем Сахасрару. Он. Поднимем наше внимание во второй 
левый центр. Мат, только ты даешь нам чистые знания, чистые творческие знания. Твою мантру Нирмалабитья. Еще раз мир молодитья. Правую руку откроем, левую положим на второй правый. Мать, я ничего не делаю. Все делаешь ты и радуешься. Мантра Сарасвати Брамадева. Левую откроем, правую положим на центр второго. Мать, ты даешь нам чистые творческие знания. Великая Сарасвати, пожалуйста, проявись в нашем втором центре. Мантра Сарасвати Брамадева. Левую руку поднимем на левый третий. Правую. Правую руку. Правую. Мать сделай нас домохозяинами. Я сам себе учитель и наставник. Мантра Груха Лакшми. Правую откроем, левую на печень. Мать, ты наше внимание, ты наш учитель, ты наш хозяин, ты наш гуру. Мантра Раджа Лакшми. Еще раз Раджа Лакши. Левую руку откроем, правой повыветриваем печень по часовой стрелочке и посбрасываем. Еще раз Раджа Лакши. Слушаем вибрации от печени на расстоянии.
левую руку плотно на печень. Нирмалчита. Обе руки откроем. Он. Правую руку на солнечное сплетение. Пожалуйста, мать, сделай нас удовлетворенными, умиротворенными, довольными всем, что мы имеем. Мантра Лакшми Вишну. Переходим на войд. Ведем правой рукой по войду по часовой стрелочке. Правая рука на сердце. Мать, пожалуйста, пребывай в наших сердцах. Открой наши сердца. У меня это тело. Не эти эмоции. Не эти мысли. Я есть Шива. Мантра Шива Парвати. Еще раз Шива Парвати. Левую руку на правое сердце. Мать, ты есть истинная ответственность у нас. Растворись всю безответственность. Установи, пожалуйста, истинную ответственность. Мантра Ситарама.
Еще раз. Внимание на центральное сердце. Великая Дурга, пожалуйста, пробудись в нашем центральном сердце. Дай нам радость, покой, уверенность. Подышим. Вдох-выдох. И простучим центральное сердце. Вдохнем и на выдохе. И подкинем несколько раз. Поем мантру Дургамата Джагадамба. Можно пальчики в пучок. Еще раз Дургамата Джагадамба. Откроем руки. Он. Левую руку на вешуге, на левую. Правую. Правую. Ой, извините, правую на левую вешуге. Я все всем прощаю. О, я ни в чем не виновен. Утверждаю. Я ни в чем не виновен. Я чистый дух. Дух ни в чем не виновен. Пармантру и Шмайя. Кроме правую руку, левую на правую шуме. Мать, только ты даешь нам нежность и ласку в наших выражениях, словах. Мантра Ишода Драупади. Еще раз. Откроем руки. Внимание на центральную вешуде. Пучком ярим впадину. Пожалуйста, сделай нас непредвзятыми свидетелями всего происходящего, всей драмы. Мантра Радха Кришна. Всю ладошку положу на горло. Еще раз. Радха Кришна.
откроем руки. Ом. Внимание на хансу чакру. На бежбровье. Мать сделай нас распознающими. Мантра Хамса Чакрас Вамини. Внимание на Адию. Я все всем прощаю, для себя прощаю. Прочитаем отче наш. Пойдем мантру Марии Иисус. Достаточно. Внимание вверх. Он. Внимание на заднюю агию, голову немножко запрокинем. Мы отпрости нам вольные и невольные ошибки против тебя, против Духа Святого. Прости всех тех, кто вольно и невольно причинял, причиняет или хочет причинить нам вред. Мантра Маха Ганеша. Внимание в Сахасраре. Помассируем. Мать уси нашу самореализацию. Укрепи нашу самореализацию. Спасибо, что ты дала нам самореализацию. Руки откроем. Мантра Шрикальки Шриматаджи. И пропоем тройную мантру.
I'm happy that you all were meditating here and we're trying to develop your depth. You all have depth, a very deep personality within yourself, but we have to touch that, that's very important. Because, you see, we sing, have music, that's a very good thing. We enjoy each other's company also is very good, and that's a nice thing, but we have to enjoy our own company also. By meditating, going within yourself. <coughs> now, what is the uh, use? One may ask, Mother, now we have got Realization, we have a nice life, we are enjoying ourselves, we are doing so well. The deeper you go, the deeper you touch the essences of all the things, like all the elements. When you had finished your meditation, you saw how the rain fell down, how the rain came suddenly. So rain has felt your depth, or you have felt the depth of rain. Now you know that <coughs> if you light one little candle and put your finger towards it, with my photograph there, it acts, it reacts, and it gives you a flame, which burns, sometimes gives you smoke, sometimes it uh, gallops. So <coughs> you have noticed that there's a reaction even in the fire. So all elements have got an effect. If a saint wants to have an effect, but first of all you must reach your own essences. Once you reach your own essences, then you reach the essences of all the elements and then you can handle all the elements as you like or you can order them as you like. First they will act, expressing that they have been touched, like today the rain came pouring down. Then <coughs> later on you can command and you can ask the rain to come, to work out many things. Uh, of that kind, we have to be deep people. We have to go much deeper within ourselves to touch our essences. That is, you know very well that all our chakras are made out of these essences. And when we go deep into ourselves, what we find that we can touch the elements very well. <coughs> While doing so, actually we move horizontally. When we start moving horizontally, at the core of it we find that there are these essences placed and these essences then start exciting the essences across. Like in the radio you have seen this ether. Now when you speak on one side of the radio, the, it gets uh, completely manifested in the essence of the ether and then everybody can hear it. Now when <coughs> you people just give a bandha, sometimes you find that you have communicated with another person. But that's only the essence of the ether, or we can say the settler of the subtlest. People have only gone onto the subtler side, we can say, by science, but you go to the subtler side and that subtler side gives you all these effects. Now you have seen also that in some of the photographs suddenly you find light coming out of my head or there's somebody shown as with a light, somebody's from the head the light is coming, you have seen all this. This is done also by the same uh, method, but here <coughs> the deities like Vishnu Maya works out. She's very active, she works it out, she does all these things. And you know that also, that when they gave me once a uh, beautiful crown in Switzerland, in the sky, they got the photograph of the same, very beautifully done. The uh, crown was there, Fatima's crown, my face, my eyes and everything so clearly. 
All this is done by Vishnu Maya. So, <coughs> all the all the essences are working out for you as well as all the deities are working out for you. They are very anxious that these things should be done and you are the channels for them to work it out. Now, for example, as I told you the other day, if you don't keep yourself all right, a simple thing I told you to put in the nose some ghee. It's a very simple thing, but that helps me a lot because that helps my Vishuddhi. But if you don't do it, I suck in in any case. Whatever problems you have, I suck in. I suck in the problem of Sahajogis, also the problem of the city where I am, also the problem of the country where I am, maybe of the whole universe. But my horizontal movement is quite large and is very subtle, and I do it quietly. <coughs> but you must also understand that you can do a lot by your horizontal movement. By horizontal movement, what happens? That you start meditating on a particular subject which is a very bothersome subject and which is for the destructive of humanity. Anything, you just put your attention to it and meditate. If you are that deep, that means if your caliber has improved to that extent, you will immediately put an effect on that. Immediately you will see there will be a change, there will be something happening in that direction. This is your power which you have to actually develop. So we have to meditate and by meditation we develop that strength within us. So automatically we <coughs> start solving the problem. Uh, like our antennae grow up to that point, uh, the way we are strong inside, uh, they grow outside to help so many things which are to be helped. Now you see that people are realizing that the world is in a great mess and there are lots of problems that have come through materialism, through wrong thinking, through emotional thinking, through stupidity, we can say. We have no time for all this. <coughs> what we have to do is to develop ourselves deeper and deeper and deeper, so that on horizontal plane also we are effective. Sahaja Yoga, first of all, is for personal improvement, is for the inner improvement as far as the personal side is concerned, means your intelligence must improve, your temperament must improve, your heart must clear out, your feelings must be all right, then you should, uh, your health should be all right, then your relationship with others should be all right, your ego should go away, your super ego should go away, all these things are there. <coughs> but this only helps a personality, just a personality that is very limited, that is yourself. But now this personality can become an instrument if you can develop that depth within yourself. But normally what happens, people are very much still worried about themselves, say about their wives, about their children, about uh, their husbands or their household or this and that. These are not important things because we have to be those instruments which are what you call them like pilotless bombs. We have to develop that depth within us that depth is possible and you can really cure many problems of your country if you could just meditate on that. Now for today <coughs> I had actually sucked in most of the problems which I felt were there in Canberra and later on in that conference and later on here. All these pro problems came into my understanding, I would say and I was trying to work on them. My working style is different because I have very sharp and very effective instruments, but I, I have to pay attention to it and I little bit suffer also, doesn't matter. Now for you also, it is important that you also develop those deeper feelings within you, deeper sense within you, but mostly people are very superficial type. They just think about their body, their impressions, uh, how they <coughs> carry themselves. At the most they think they have to be very legal-minded 
or we have to be uh, at the most not drinking, not smoking, and <coughs> all these things are achieved and we have achieved everything. But I think that is not so. And second point is that we think that if we love each other, if we love Mother, that is the end of everything. It's not true also. Because your love for Me uh, is there, no doubt, and it should be intense, it should be deeper. But the deeper you go into that love, then you will be surprised how you receive a special quality of correcting the things that are wrong around you. Gradually that quality improves. For example, a surgery goes to anybody's house, that house must become auspicious. But such a surgery must have a good heart. If the heart is not good, in the heart there is still anger, passion, uh, lust, greed, then such a heart won't affect. But a person who has purified himself, if he goes into any family, any household, any society, the whole change will take place. The circumstances will change. <coughs> Things that do not work out will start working out immediately. Like they said, Mother, as soon as you sent from this Sunday, everything started working out uh, as far as the television is concerned and radio is concerned and all that. I didn't do anything, in a way. But that should happen with you also. Wherever a saint goes, things are changing. But you have to be a saint, and a saintly person has a very deep understanding of another person. And this is what it is lacking. Uh, we don't have that deep understanding for each other, then even if you have for uh, some of your own friends or maybe in the same uh, ashram that you are staying in all that, but it should deepen much more. It should go further and further. Now even if you think of Me, it works out. It's the other way around also. But first of all, the meditative process should be increased. We all must meditate, that is very important. Meditate sincerely, not just because we have to meditate, but because we have to be deep, we have to grow within, to express our great powers of Divine Love, to correct so many things, which you can do very easily. I know you all can do it. There's no need to have big degrees for that, uh, big education for that. Nothing is needed. What is needed is a deep feeling of love for the whole universe. And that changes. The all destructive forces change their course and it is then for the constructive force. But on the whole, uh, that works out much faster if you all do that meditation with sincerity, with intensity, with understanding. All right? May God bless you. <coughs> it is much more than our music, much more than my lectures or anything that we have to do. And now the course has to change. I'm sure you people will take to the new course. May God bless you for that. Дорогие матчи, давайте положим правую руку на левое сердце и три раза скажем. Мать Богиня, пусть наша чистая любовь действует на всех людей планеты Земля.
Поднимем кундалини и дальше будем медитация. Сейчас мы